The title of the film is The Birth of the Bell Helicopter. But first, a few words about Arthur M. Young, the inventor of the Bell Helicopter. A native of Philadelphia, Young was born in 1905. He studied mathematics at Princeton, where he graduated in 1927. He felt a very strong urge to invent something radically new and spent some time casting about for a field of activity. By December of 1928, he had finally decided to devote the next 15 years of his life to inventing and creating a helicopter. Arthur Young's initial method was to spend a week or so in various cities, such as Philadelphia, Washington, Detroit, and New York. He would check into a hotel room and spend his days in public libraries, looking up all the entries he could find under the word helicopter. In this way, he became well-versed in the patent literature and the history of early helicopter research. He found that a helicopter had succeeded in hovering for a few minutes in Ohio in 1923, and he read accounts of the experiments of many pioneers in the field. His next step was to set up a small aeronautical laboratory in the barn of his family's home in Radnor, near Philadelphia. In 1929, if you announced that you were working on a helicopter, you were considered eccentric, to say the least. And if you were a young man of independent financial means, as Arthur Young was, it took lots of courage and persistence to devote your full energies to what was thought of as a crazy invention. But persist he did. <laughs> 